go back to his early days as Prime Minister of India when he made his debut, so to say. He was ridiculed for you know being a frequent flyer. Yes. I mean, nobody had then had the, 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 the vision to see that this will come back one day. These flights think, out be became flights inward, right? I think Prime Minister Modi is not deterred when he is humiliated or mocked. He works to a plan. He knows exactly why he's putting in an effort in a particular direction and how that will fructify for the betterment of the country. If Prime Minister Modi was to be disobeyed by humiliation, he wouldn't be Prime Minister. If you remember in 2013, the Congress party mocked him. The chai wala can never be prime minister. So this is an unstoppable administrative good governance machine. He's not deterred by humiliation or slight remarks. A man, very, very interesting, but a man who was ridiculed uh, or for not having a parivar. Now suddenly he is playing the most key role, one in terms of welfare of every parivar, and suddenly think, the Modi ka parivar, or Modi ji parivar uh, I think slogan. The fact that uh, I have seen his political journey up close for over two decades. I've seen him as chief minister and then as prime minister. His country is his life. His country is his family. Uh, he verbalizes it now. He's never verbalized it before. He has lived every moment of his life as I have seen him. Completely dedicated to how to make things better for people. And he's always thinking of what to do next. So he's not somebody who after achieving uh, a particular goal is satisfied enough to say okay now let's sit back and enjoy uh, the uh, the achievement per se he's somebody who knows that we as a country deserve better prospects he knows as a country we are a talent pool that the world has never seen before we are a force of nature to reckon with and he is insistent on ensuring that every Indian gets an equal opportunity to leverage that talent, contribute to nation building and do better. Uh, because he knows that a stronger India is a great global force.